Hey everybody, my name is Ian Miller and welcome back to The Mailbag. Today we are going to talk about the women's simple strap. That is this strap right here. Uh, it's sitting right next to our stock shoulder strap. Uh, as you can see, there is a little bit of difference here. The primary difference is our stock straps uh, do have pockets on them. The women's simple strap is really designed to cut underneath the uh, armpit area and without the pockets there's not going to be any crowding in the chest area. So let's just overlap both shoulder straps so we can see the actual shape difference. The length is pretty much the same but as you can see the strap has a strong curve here and again that's going to go underneath uh, your arm area a little higher up not crowd the chest area. Now some of the questions that I get regarded to the simple strap primarily revolve around can a man use the simple strap or do you offer a strap uh, without pockets on it? I want something uh, maybe for urban use uh, that's not as busy, uh, etc. Personally, in most cases, I'm still going to use the stock strap urban, mountain, whatever, I do prefer to have the pockets on here, but I understand not everybody does. So I just want to make this video uh, primarily for men to show them that uh, this strap is more than fine uh, on a male torso. Uh, we did design it for women. Again, it uh, cuts away from the breast area, but it also has this dual sternum strap feature, which I'll demonstrate in just a second. So let's take the Action X30 here and just quickly attach it. Just undo the Velcro. We will position the strap uh, just like this. So the strap is facing upward. Tuck it under the webbing loop. Close the first side of Velcro, close the second. Now you always wanna make sure that you compress the Velcro together. It's really important that you do that. That way there's no pulling and uh, the Velcro will not come apart. Then just quickly zip it up, take the webbing, place it through the ladder lock and back. And that's gonna allow the ladder lock to actually lock in place. And you'll wanna do the same thing lower down. Just like that. Now we do have strap keepers here, so you'll want to thread it through the strap keeper. Okay, so there we go. So let's just put the bag on. Now you can see without the sternum strap secured, it does have a nice uh, more traditional backpack fit. The straps will kind of pull a little more outward to the outer edges of your shoulders and, and just kind of rest there. If you had a lot of weight in there, this might become uncomfortable after a while. So you'll want to secure the sternum strap. Now you can wear this bag with just the one sternum strap, more than fine, but it does have this dual sternum strap design. And that design itself is going to spread the weight across the chest more. It'll be similar to our stock shoulder strap, except for women, they'll be able to adjust these straps so there isn't a sternum strap coming across the chest area. Now, if you're a male using these straps, and you have the dual sternum strap set up, I'd advise using it in situations when you know you're gonna be hiking for quite a while and you're probably not gonna be in and out of your bag just because uh, it provides so much more uh, support and weight distribution across your rib area or your chest and provides a lot more comfort over longer periods of time. You can see here again, the strap cuts uh, more underneath my armpit area, whereas our stock strap is going to sit much like this. So if you don't want to use the dual sternum strap, just kind of tighten up one end. You can roll it up and just tuck it into the strap keeper and you'll have it just like that. So again, this is what it's gonna look like on most males. If you're looking for a simple solution, uh, you wanna get away from the pocket design, maybe you're in an urban environment, maybe you just like the simpler style, or maybe you're just looking for a different fit from our backpacks. Uh, why not give the simple strap a try? Take care and we will see you next time on The Mailbag. Thanks.